Netflix comes along and say, hey, we got a cool idea. Here's our idea. Instead of letting people go to Blockbuster, Blockbuster was like, what? Not come to us? Instead of letting people come to Blockbuster, how about they sit at home and their media comes in the mail? Blockbuster was like, that's a stupid idea. Said, all right, they came back a little time later. They said, hey, this idea is really picking up steam. You know, everybody can't get out like that. And the late fees, y'all tripping on those. So how about you partner with us? And they said, no, nah, we good on that. They came back a while later and said, okay, listen, listen, this thing is taking off. We, $50 million, you can buy our company. Blockbuster was like, no, we good on that. The market shifted. Don't nobody go to Blockbuster no more. Blockbuster came back and said, ah, uh, Netflix, ah, uh, can we... Netflix said, no, we good on that. <laughs> they could have purchased it for 50 million. Now Netflix is worth billions. And now the market is shifted because no longer do you have to wait for your content to come in the mail. You push a button on your screen. But you see how Blockbuster romanticized their past so much that they never thought that people would move on from where they were positioned. The challenge for us is that we're trying to ask for a blockbuster type anointing and a Netflix culture. 